What's up guys, Vernon here, Poggy Boy Productions. We're here at Italy in Fort Hills Mall. Just opened up last week, November, first week of November. So this is like the second week. And uh, you know, there's two locations in New York I've never been to. I think one of them is by the Oculus. So this is big because it's here in New Jersey. Authentic Italian food. They, they have a big restaurant, they have a nice store. You can sell, you can buy some pasta, whatever you need. Everything's here. So we're gonna try the food. I'll let you know how it is. And uh, yeah, keep watching. pasta here all the fresh sauces tomato some cheese, some fresh mozzarella, burrata. So we went to the eatery shop and I went to buy a sandwich because the restaurant requires a reservation, an open table. So I ended up getting something small for a snack and dinner won't be till like two hours from now. So I figure I'll put something in my tummy before then. So let's see what I got. I got the Proschiotto Cotto Tramezzino. Made in Italy from our kitchen to yours. Okay, nice little sandwich. Lemonade. I got the San Pellegrino Limonata. This is lemonade. Made with Italian lemons. I haven't tried this. Well, I heard it's pretty good. So, all right. This is just an appetizer for the mini event later. All right, let's try the sandwich. I'm just gonna get one. I don't want to be too full because you know Italians love to eat and I'm pretty sure it's going to be a lot of food later so uh, I think this is like prosciutto it's like it's like a ham got some uh, green leaves <laughs> all right It's 
pretty good. Get a lot of uh, prosciutto in there. Okay, I think there's some mayonnaise. Yeah, there's mayonnaise here. It's pretty good, not bad. This is a really tasty appetizer. Mm. Oh. It was either this or the salad, and I went with this. Not bad. Nice pop. Here we go. Oh yeah, very lemonade, <laughs> fizzy. That's a good word for it. But uh, yeah, it's pretty good. It's, this is an Italian brand, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Nice. Compliments well in my sandwich. Cheers, guys. <laughs> so I got myself chocolate gelato. Might be the most basic flavor ever, but you know what? I'm a plain guy and I love my chocolate, as you probably already know. Mmm, <laughs> chocolate. Sorry if I mispronounced it. It's house made takia and the pasta with pork and beef and a la bolognese and something else. Parmigiano Reggiano, which is the I guess the red sauce. Looks pretty good. Looks like spaghetti. <laughs> there you go. All right, let's try this. Uh, I would just I'm just gonna call it spaghetti, even though it's not. <laughs> It looks like spaghetti. Anyway, this is uh, you got the you got the noodles here. Look at that. All right. Bon appetit. Yeah, so the noodles are nice, nice long, they're fresh, you can tell they're made fresh. And you got the beef, you got the little parcel, little portions of beef cut, cut up. Mm. Is the margarita al water di caro. So this pizza dates back to the late 1500s, when Neapolitan poet the Lord Dinello described it like the wheel of a cart. Hence the name. Okay. I like I like the look of it. it looks like a well cooked pizza. All right, let's try this margarita pie. You got some uh, greens on it. There's a nice little uh, burn, little burn to the crust. Let's see the undercarriage. Okay, the food. You can see it's a little uh, toasted underneath. No flop. Very, very, uh, <laughs> you know, doesn't hold up well. But I want to fold it like New York style and eat something. 
Yeah, I like it. I mean, there's not a lot of uh, a lot of cheese here. You can see some tomato sauce, and it's very very thin. It's not uh, it's not your average, it's not your typical New York, New Jersey pie, right? Mmm, very good. Work of art. <laughs> I like that the waitress comes around and gives you more salt if you want more salt to your to your pasta. one of their cocktails. I believe it's Prosecco something something. Don't ask me what's in it. Looks like a very, looks like an orange juice that's been uh, spiked. <laughs> nice orange color to it. Let's try it. Oh, I felt that one. <laughs> I think if you have enough of this, you're probably gonna feel it. But it's a uh, nice, Fizzy drink. Um, it's like a spiked orange juice, pretty much. Not bad. I like it. Look at that. The dessert has the Italy name on it. I think this is the chocolate mousse. Something, something. I don't even know how to pronounce it, but this looks pretty good. I'm just waiting for my cappuccino before I dig in to some sweetness. Let's eat this. I don't know how I'm gonna. I don't want to ruin this work of art here, <laughs> but of course I have to choose it because it's chocolate. You know me, I'm, it's my favorite. Can't say no to chocolate. Oh yeah, that's nice and soft. I can just see it. I can see some caramel in there. Yeah. That's heaven on a plate. <laughs> nice, soft, moist, and very chocolatey. Just the way I like it. Italy did a good job with dessert. And of course, I had to get cappuccino. Goes well with any dessert. Ah, perfect. Perfect way to end an Italian meal. <laughs> so full. Well, hope you guys enjoyed that video. That is Italy here in Short Hills Mall. That mall is a little bougie. It's a little uh, rich for my taste, but I'm glad that they have another restaurant, another place to showcase some good Italian eats. I know there are a few places, like I said, in New York. I think there's three of them, right? I'm not sure. But now that it's here in New Jersey, I don't have to travel all the way to New York. Although if you are from New York, you probably want to go somewhere closer to there it is their grand opening week and as you can see they had several events during lined up for each day uh, as for the food i like the pasta that i got don't even tell me how to say the name because i'm not going to pronounce it but uh it's looked like spaghetti the noodles were just a little bit more thicker and uh yeah it's it's it was a great i liked it um i also had the 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 marinara um the pizza uh they call that i forget <laughs> Uh, it's actually the next day so I kind of forget the, the names of the, the pizza I ate but it's uh, as authentic as it comes uh, I like that it's thin thin crust it's very it's not very heavy dough, dough heavy um, and it's a nice mixture of uh, 
you know sauce and cheese and it's not heavy per se although we did it oh well, actually we did finish the whole box of pizza and we took home the pasta uh, and the dessert oh my goodness that was the best I loved it it was a it was just filled with chocolate got the caramel on the bottom and uh, yeah it was a uh, definitely worth the experience uh, I would suggest reserving if you go there I think they have a uh, you reserve through open table online or give them a call although when I tried to call them it was a hit or miss so uh, yeah if you guys want to visit again it's in Short Hills Mall here in New Jersey so if this is your first time here make sure you guys subscribe down below hit that red button see so and then uh, ring the bell so you get notified of all our future videos like comment and share give us some big likes because it will help with the algorithm and uh we'll see you in the next video thanks guys